I want you to talk to Pooh. You know that's my niece, right? Why you ain't calling my dad a funeral? They hurt my feelings so bad. Okay, well, since we're gonna talk about it, we're gonna talk you about it. You gonna apologize to me about that? <laughs> Just about my daddy funeral. I do apologize because okay. I come to your dad's funeral because you know I, I love your dad. Little Rob, crazy. So I was like, and you know what? And then I'm gonna tell you before we start. Um, I got so to my ass in my head. Hold on. Nail, mm-hmm. or whatever, and. And they came to my dad. So that was like a really big thing to me. You know, like I really appreciated her for, you know, coming. And she knew my dad. They had a relationship. So although we weren't talking, like, didn't get the funeral information from me or anything in any case. Mm-hmm. So that was like a really big thing, you know, for But me. Kim messaged me and said, I think you should call Pooh because her dad just died. But, and, you know, like a message. I remember she messaged it or whatever. And I was like, do I say something to her because her dad died or do not? I was still upset. Yeah. But then I'm the type of person, like, when I get upset, I don't care. And I, my stepmom said, I get this from my daddy. When I'm upset, I don't care how another person feels because ISIS is upset. So I, and you know what you you put that in the group text. Yeah, I remember. Mm-hmm. I no, I said I know exactly what I said. Y'all say ISIS. No, I you said, said you said me. I should I should do yeah. that, and then you said. But what y'all didn't understand yeah, was she removed herself out of the group text. Yeah, I, I said what I said. I said I'm looking out for ISIS, just yeah, like y'all looking out for Robin. Yeah. But see, the thing was, I wasn't even upset at that. It was just a simple fact that Robin and I have our own relationship, right? right. I have my own relationship with everybody else. She could have called me personally and said it. ISIS, could you do blah, blah, blah. So I'm working when I got the text message, right? No, I wasn't working. I was driving down past Immaculate Conception. I was driving down the street and my phone was sitting and I was bloop, 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 bloop. I'm still driving, I picked it up. And everybody like, ISIS, yeah, she was blah, blah, blah. ISIS. I'm like, oh, yeah, excuse me, I'm sorry. I'm like, oh, y'all, Robin could have called me and said, ISIS, this is how I feel, blah, 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 blah. I didn't read no messages, but ISIS, you should do this. ISIS, you should do that. I said, I'm looking out for ISIS, just yeah, like y'all looking out for uh, Robin. Exactly and I received that we I, did have a relationship, but when when they told me, and not even going deeper to what was said, mm-hmm. when they told me that in the in court or whatever, not once did I think, like, because at that point, I, I thought, like, say it. at that point, I thought, like, it, it, it's, it's over with, like, right. They took it upon themselves to say that. Like, I never would have came to you because I didn't want to ask you to do it. It was already... But you I already had, you had said court. it. You had said it and then all them... No, judges. I said what the person, what they said, you said in the courtroom to do. No, you the said, yeah, you said your lawyer said to say this. To say this. To say this. Right this. But my no, thing you was... You didn't have to come, right? No, but this was my thing. Mm-hmm. But this was my thing. So I'm going to keep it funky. You said... And you can edit this out if you want to. Don't say nothing. Yeah, because we can't say nothing that's going to get us in trouble. So, <laughs> it, please, edit this out. I was like, at this point, f- everybody. I don't care. F- everybody. I just stop talking to everybody. <laughs> yeah. And I think a lot of times with 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 family and and friendships, a lot y'all text messages is so fucked up. It makes yeah. us because you don't you, really you don't know the, 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 yeah, the yeah, yeah. You, yeah. you don't know the tone of the text. That's so true. Misinterpreted a lot of times. Somebody called me one time and I was like, hey girl, I text you. She was like, uh uh-uh. uh. I don't like the text because tones are misinterpreted. I don't that's true. know that's how true. you're saying that. Yeah. And I don't want to be, that's for real. be that is offended true. or feel no type of way. Sometimes I can be like, girl, just do it. To you, in your mind, depending on how you think I feel already, your so feelings you gonna, are already formed. Exactly. Right? You're going to be like, she's saying, girl, just do it. <laughs> but I might be like, girl, just do it. Go ahead. Yeah. You know? yeah. Right. But because you don't hear my voice, you don't see my face, you don't know how yeah. I feel. And I, and I tell Mario and Juke that all the time. You like, read it. Don't text because yeah. it, it could be taken out of context. Oh, so oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah right. that's true. I can yeah. use uh, Gigi for an example because I'm sure she wouldn't mind, you know. You know, we fell out for a while. And when we finally started big talking, one of the things that we talked about was like, 
if we had just communicated with one another. Yeah. Right. Instead of her going to somebody, me going to somebody, then her going to somebody, then me going to somebody, and then after I heard she said that, then it's I said it. that, and then mm-hmm. fuck her. Back you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. That's how it go. Yeah. Like, yeah. it's immediately to that because you have not talked to the person. Yeah. And I think sometimes as women, we just been taught to, if a person say something to us that we don't like or we don't want to hear or uh, we don't feel is correct, she hating on you, she don't like you, she's uh, being sneaky, uh, X her out. Yeah. But I think we need to work more on, I mean, being being honest with one another, yeah. but in a way where it doesn't have to be nasty. Yeah. You know, you just basically, I'm giving you to some game. Right. And right. However you want to receive it. I'm, True. I don't want to, and I don't know what's a nice way to say that really, but... I guess this is something we can, I guess, kind of figure out to talk about. So now we're going to answer some questions that you guys gave us on our relationship segment. So we have about eight questions that we're going to all just run through right quick. It's not going to be long. It's just going to get our little input on, you know, how we feel about you. Don't knock my head. Hush. <laughs> okay. So how do you keep a relationship fresh? Kim mm-hmm. is the only one that's in a relationship. <laughs> that don't mean she's the only one. First of all, all yes. I'm in a relationship. Yes. With who? <laughs> a couple of people. Anyway, anyway. Entanglement. Well, I feel that you should keep a relationship fresh by continuing to do the things that you did to get there. Right. Oh, right. And that goes for the man or the woman. Right. Yes. Don't, get com- don't get comfortable. comfortable. Yes. Oh, people Go do get on comfortable. dates. Mm-hmm. Still Give dates. me flowers. Yes. yes. Okay. Please. You know, I'm, I'm, I'm the... The best at the cards yeah. and making yeah. you feel, yeah. you know, mm-hmm. appreciated and loved. Yeah. You know, yeah, yeah keep it being spicy. spontaneous. Yeah. 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 things that keep you and your spicy. partner wouldn't normally do. Right. Yeah. Right. Jay and I do get in the middle of the floor and dance. Oh, and Aww. I mean, that's random. He don't like to dance. He's never been a person that want to do like anything that make him feel silly. So like. Making your partner feel comfortable with you yeah. Yeah. in moments where it would normally be awkward for them mm-hmm. or something like that, just to kind of break the like break the ice yeah. at home, yeah. Right. So that when y'all are out, it don't seem like oh, yeah. yeah. I don't even know if we go together. You know what I mean? <laughs> yeah, right. I've just been wanna, up. You want to keep the relationship open to new things always. always. Yes. Okay. All right. So the next question is: Is it okay for a man not to introduce you to his family after you all have been dating for five months? I need to at least know one of your cousins after five months. <laughs> Same. Well, take me out for two of your right. cousins or something. Well, maybe they don't take you serious if they hadn't. I'm yeah. not gonna say that. I, I feel like you serious I if they like hadn't talking about me. introduced you. But sometimes you know mm. it, it depends because with my family or with my immediate family, with my brothers and my mom. I'm not bringing you around. I'm not no. constantly yeah. introducing no. them to people. No. people Unless I really right. like you yeah. and I know it's going to be longevity. Yeah. You're not me and my family. And yeah. that's how I am too, especially about me and meeting my kids. It's my brother's Because kids. Yeah. I don't want my kids to keep meeting new people, especially yeah. if it's not going to be a long-term relationship. Right. And so... Yeah, <laughs> I've so. never, my kids have only really, you know, they might know somebody that I may be talking to or dating or something, but I'm not being good the on, in the house, right, yeah. uh-uh, like men just coming over all the time. It's none of that. It's, yeah. it's either, if it's serious, then they there. If it's not, then they not, yeah. you know, yeah. so. Yeah. Well, I, Y'all just slapping in my face because uh, <laughs> I'm thinking about who everybody family I ain't met. <laughs> right. I'm like, and you know, I ain't never met his family. I ain't never met nobody. It depends on but the man. Yeah, I just, it depends. It depends but they might not even be close to their family. Right. But then, like with me, I'm the type of person I really kind of sort of don't want to meet you anyway. anyway. Yeah, yeah, same. And then like, I don't like y'all. And I'm, I'm like, I'm very, very like secretive. Like, yeah. Yeah. if you meet my family, it's by you introducing yourself. If I have, you know, like, yeah. <laughs> you're like, hey, and a lot I'm of people not doing be like, well, I ain't dating the family no way, so why I gotta meet yeah. them? You know, this some people, but well, I'm just real family oriented. So if yeah. I love you and I want to be with you, I want you around my family because right. we do so much together. Yes. So I want yes. you, and that's the reason yeah. why I like, don't I literally want. And that's the reason why I don't want to bring people around because I know how we are. So I know like. They'll fall in love with us. Y'all probably fall in love with them. And then, boom, y'all got a relationship. And then, even and then I don't want them like that. So, yeah, you know, it's like, I don't really want them like that. Yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. We had, look, yeah, we got Ray. We still had our daddy. I mean, it's cool. Oh, no, I'm just saying, that's, that's, that's yeah. what happens yeah. when, you know. Yeah. I was thinking about your boy who came to the, 
to the thing and said, and don't say his name, but you know who came and said, I go with ice. Uh, yeah. I'm like, why would you do that? Yeah. Like, he wanted your family to but know. But I, I right. didn't say that. I know. He loved, you. he loved you, boo. <laughs> he still, he claimed he do. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Next question. How do you guys please your man? Oh. I think that's personal. That right. is very private. I just do you what do your man likes. Like. I, do, I was just about right. to say that. I do what okay. he likes. I do what, what do he, he likes me to do. You need to know your partner's love language. Yes. 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 That is so weird. Yeah. Like, uh, you need to know if your man like you to rub the back of his head mm-hmm. or to touch him on his back if, in a If they way. like public displays yeah. of yeah. affection. Yeah. Some people it. don't. Yeah. Right. Like Mario said on, on the episode, there's no perfect person, but I think you should be perfect for your mate. Yes. Yeah. Right. Yeah. I, yeah. I told yeah. Mario, yeah. ain't no rule for perfectly. messing up with me. Yeah. Um, you need to be I, yeah. I, I told this one guy that um, I was saying that like he's perfect. For, I, I be telling for, him you're perfect. He'd be like, I'm not perfect. I'm like, yeah, you're perfect for me. Like, right. Ooh, wow. I like how you are. I like yeah. everything about you. I think that you're perfect for me. He'd be like, I'm right. not perfect though. I do this. Mm-hmm. Nah, but right. I think he is. Mm. Yeah. But he not. <laughs> now, at you first I thought he was perfect. Thought he was, right. Yeah. It'd be like that in the beginning, okay. huh? Butterflies and lies. Right. Yes. Okay. Yes. Yeah. Butterflies and lies do go together. Sure do. <laughs> they don't. Mm-hmm. This, like this a, this a, Most of the time we have butterflies. That's a bubble guts and lies. <laughs> <laughs> That's what that is, bubble right. guts and lies. Okay, next question. Is withholding information the same as lying? Yes. No. no. That's because she'll no. withhold information. No. That's the only reason why she no. did that. I think if you withhold it, how are you lying if you haven't even told? If you ain't asked me. You ain't asked. So, so why ain't like, you looking in my face not telling me? <laughs> and it That's may a lie. not be. But you know, you know I want to know. If you right. ask me, then I would tell you. If you do not right. ask me, I'm not lying. lying. You're not, not lying. No. I ain't saying no nothing. Reason. But you lying to me because you ain't told me. Oh, you know oh, I want to know that. Whatever. No. It ain't lying. It's, well, not lying. it's not lying, but it's a form of dishonesty. It's yeah. not honesty. <laughs> they never do anything. Be honesty lying. and lying. It's, it's the same lying. thing. <laughs> Be honest with me, baby. Please, and let me know because right. I want to know. Be what, careful with me. Okay. Don't omit. Handle me right. That's the thing. Don't omit. Right. Yeah, Tell me it. because don't you omit. know I want to know. Well, but I, well, I'm not it now. <laughs> exactly because it's like whatever you feel like so you got to have. It's like, okay, you got a baby on the way. You didn't ask me if I had a baby on the way. Yeah. But you didn't tell me. I'm like, they and, the, and then what they say, what they say, Kim, what you say about the uh, snap? I ain't what? tell you was gonna be on snap. Oh, yeah, I, that's true. Uh, <laughs> you didn't tell me that. Well, I didn't tell you I was gonna come out with a can of face. I didn't surprise you. But I think that is lying. Yeah. Okay. Next question. Why do women always get stuck with the kids? Mama, baby, daddy's maybe. Oh, I don't want to be my daddy anyway. Papa, so. Prefer to be with the mom instead of the daddy. The daddy can be strict just, or it's maybe it's just tradition. The mom, yeah, the mom, the mom, the mom always had a baby. Yeah. You know, I, it's just, have any, I mean, we have one of y'all ever stay with y'all daddy. My um, mama, I was a mama's girl. Have you ever stayed with your father? I did. But he here. would fall asleep and get drunk. I'm saying like stay like by yourself. With him. Like had to live with. No, him. Of course not. He will fall asleep and get drunk. Okay. It was dangerous. I had my mom's car. I did not steal it. She let me drive it. But I had a car wrecked it. She said, "You got to go." So you had to go stay with your dad. She, she. I said, well, "I want to go stay with Jerry." She said, "No, you got to go stay with your dad." I was like, "What? This, you know, like we don't even have a relationship." <laughs> yeah. Like he, I had a relationship with him, but he was so mean. He's yeah. so so mean. So mm-hmm. I went over there, and when you was talking about the twenty dollars a day, he'll give you twenty dollars a day, right? But um, he's so mean. You you scared to talk to him. <laughs> you know, know um, I ain't gonna say that. But I was trying to say something else. But it was just I was scared to go to sleep in the. <laughs> I was like, <laughs> I want to go home. I call my mom. Please, can I come home? They make me clean up every day. They make me clean up. I gotta go home. It was like they mess up the whole house, and then they be like, ISIS coming. I'm like, I'm not a maid. Like, what's going on? I called my mom. I was like, Mom, please, cause she said you gonna you gonna act right. I'm like, yeah, baby. I came over, came home. I was telling my dad, can you please drop me back out at my mom's house, please? I, know, I right. think it's just traditional for yeah. I don't I ever the kids. Yeah, yeah. I didn't ever want to live with me and get them on the weekend. Yeah, mother yeah. nurture. You know. Yeah. Yeah. I just feel like like it's nobody like your mama. Like right. nobody, She's baby. Right. I nobody. used to get into it with her. I used, she used to put me out. You do have a few good I men. You do have a great day. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, you know, that's and still good not on a scale of mothers though. But right. it's like every girl wants they, it, every they boy too wants their mother. Yeah, right. even though my mom is like yeah, not yeah, I know me and affectionate yeah. or nothing like that. My different mom, kind of my and it's mom. different love with a boy. Yeah, yeah, it is. Yeah, that's how she is with Kenny Bane. Like yeah. she just she affectionate with, him, but with us. I said now I see why um, Mario and Juke mama were fighting. Don't do right, babe. 
I say I'm just saying uh, like, how, yeah. you know, like how you know it's just a different kind of like love I love Ray more than anything else in this world, but it's just a it's just different. Like I love both my kids equally, but you weak for change. Yeah, I mean I get weak for Ray. You, no, she, but she you're is, weaker for change, maybe because he, you know, he a boy and or the you know, smile. he's smaller, yeah. younger, you know. Yeah. But the, the boys are because that's how I was, you know, weak for King. You know, like it was different. I don't see how y'all weak for their baby. I know, right? They <laughs> I'm not weak for. I may be a little weak for Ray, but yeah. the boys, they baby. We all know Ray your favorite. Okay. <laughs> okay, moving on. Shout out to Reagan. Reagan Chanel. Ray Ray. Ray, Ray. Ray, Ray. <laughs> yeah, she's gonna be like, yeah, put that part on my TikTok. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Okay. What do you require from a man? I when require respect. See. Respect. I require time. Require honesty. Honesty. honesty loyalty. Sure. Right. Yes. I think those three are amazing. This all of all, all of that. Um, <laughs> I just feel like that, right? Like that is the bare minimum. I feel like that's what you're supposed to do, right? right. But like, um, I I want a guy to like, like be what is the word I'm looking for? Like chivalrous or whatever. Yeah, chivalrous. Yeah, yeah. I, I want that. Um, yeah. Consistent. Yeah. Yes. I just yes. want. I just want to be treated like. Yes. I just want to be treated like you love me. You can't. Yes. You know what I mean. Something handle me. Yeah. It happens. No so handle me. Like, yeah. like Cardi B said, that's, like, be careful with me. This would be a thing with me. People yeah. come in and you be like, oh, he's. You know, y'all know how I talk to y'all. Like he's, oh, he's so cool. I think it. And then just change like, like a you have face. to be consistent. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Like, yeah. But see, right. I'm gonna tell you where that goes because when you tell it, don't, that's what I've learned now. I don't want a guy ask me questions like that. I'm very vague. Like, what do you look for in a man? What 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 do you want? What do you expect from a man? I try to be as vague as hell because they're not gonna do nothing. You ain't doing nothing but giving them a playbook on how to deal right, with right, it right. for at least a month or two. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So I try to like I'm answering questions with questions like I'm gonna just try to see what you're about. You're gonna have to figure me out. But yeah, yeah. yeah. I would yeah. hope you treat me how you think. Yeah, I, I should, should be treated. Treat. Yeah. Yeah. Right. How special am I to, to you? Yeah, yeah. Exactly. I, I don't think. It, I think at a certain age, though, women have to just just decide, hey, this is what I am and am not going to require to, of a man. To yeah. accept. If, he, yeah. if right. this is what I'm saying, I'm looking for. Regardless is, if we share kids together. Yeah. If, like, if, if we have known each other for 39 years. <laughs> 30 This days, is what I want. Yes. If you cannot give it to me, go on about we can business. still be friends. Right. I will speak to you when I see you. We just cannot be in a relationship. Yeah, we're not, we're not meant to be lovers. Did okay, I? I have one question, and it's not on there okay. while we're on this topic. So I've had like a couple of guys to DM me and say, I or even just talking to them, you know, they would say like, um, I really like you. I really want to get to know you, but I'm afraid to try to talk to you because I feel like I feel like I can't be what you need. Yeah, yeah you don't need him. So what do you do? Yeah, yeah, that, I really he's not yeah. confident. You don't yeah. need him. He's not confident yeah. because that ain't gonna. What you get with him, he ain't gonna do number be a lump on the log, constantly nagging about what well, I get. I, I I'm sorry, I, I can't do, do that. Yeah, all that. What she's saying, like you yeah. don't want to be a confident man because you Yeah, because of who your brothers are, I know. Um, I can't. Yes, you can. Mute. Yeah. 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 We're going to leave it there. Next. Yeah. You, okay. I'm confident, baby. I need a you, you just yeah. Exactly. Person. You need to tell them, like, if confidence you're not confident in who you are, why would I even date you? Right. Thanks, right. but no thanks. Yeah. Exactly. And, and I think people people know, especially people who are trying to date you, they know when you're confident and when you're not. Right. Yep. Yeah. And, and they prey on it. Yeah, the yeah. manipulative ones. Yes. They'll yes. get on, you latch on. Uh huh. While you're down, digging in the garbage can, they're going. <laughs> Yeah, they gonna get on in the garbage can. They get on in it. Get them out. Okay. Okay. Next question: Is it okay for a man to not work as hard in a relationship as he did in the beginning after y'all have been together for a while? No, no, no. No. We already kind of talked about that. Yeah, like you already know, it's a negative. Be consistent. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Be consistent. I mean, it's if you if would you go to a restaurant that. You went there the first time. The if free was, was good, good, the fire the first time. You want and then to you, be, and they come back and it's yeah, not good. You you want they not food. Yeah, right, I right. need my food to be you good every time I come. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, I need my food to be fire every it's time. Free bag lamb chops good every time you come. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I write that. I, I need you to be into perfection, and I might need one. And right now. it was my this first time eating it with y'all that that night. Oh, oh, you eat meat. Yeah, she eat meat. She just don't eat beef or pork. Oh, that lamb. Or chicken. Was oh. yeah. So that's what I'm saying. And I said, what's lamb, y'all? Is it this beef? They said lamb this is lamb. lamb. Yeah. <laughs> lamb. 
Lamb. Okay. Last question. Last guys. question, guys. How do you spice up the six? Ooh. <laughs> this, I'm going to let y'all go because this is a really How big subject for me. How do you get spicy? You can you get yes. spicy. Look him. Uh, I, I suggest she just made it with the tiny. with the orange lingerie for yeah. one. Mm-hmm. Um, I know, um, like you know, just speaking from personal experience, you know, Jay and I started dating young. He definitely was not into lingerie. It, even when I would mention it when we was like twenty one, you know, young. See, you he like, why you trying to buy something sexy? I ain't without it. I just want to take it off. You know, like. Yeah. But like now, like if I pop out with a little spice, he'd be like, hey, what's going on? <laughs> Jay's so you, funny. Where you get that from? So so funny. You know, so it's like. Yeah, that's so funny. Like, you know, something that just let a man know she ain't coming with this same yeah. gum that she chewed up. And <laughs> Baby, that's me panties with the whole thing. This same look lace, it's smelling like lace. You okay. know, you know, <laughs> oh, baby, they looking for something different. Look, spice, you know, <laughs> look just him. a little sprinkle or something like this. Or even just, just talking talk. about it, like, <laughs> yeah, like what's your desires or yeah, yeah. Like, Guess what, what turn you on? Or I've never wore lingerie right. for anybody. Really, never. Why? The first time you I ever so this yeah. yeah. Exactly. The first Why? time I listen, let me break y'all face. Oh, the first no. time I the first time I ever had a thong, Erica bought it for my birthday. I was probably like 20 something. Really? Some no, underwear. I, I see. But the first time, I used to be, I never even had. Tomboy. She I, just I never even tomboy. had, I never even slept with a guy that wasn't my boyfriend until now. Yeah. Yes. That's the old, that's now, and I never even like been outside of a bed. Y'all spice it up, y'all. Yeah, you yeah. Spice, <laughs> spice it up. Spice it up. Be spice it up. Communicate about what your <laughs> mate likes and what they dislike. Yes, um, that is very. What lovely. are um be open minded fantasies? You know, like yeah. something a person but has never done and yeah. that yeah. they yeah. want to do. Yeah. Yeah. I like that now. Be open minded. Yes, yes. Always open minded. So, so trying new things. I know. I never had phone six. I had FaceTime six. Is it phone six? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Now they got the thing you put on the bed. You can hang your phone. What? what? Do I need oh to put it on Amazon? So sexy. Oh. <laughs> okay. So that was the best <laughs> conversation. I Thanks love for the questions. Question. You edited out some of that. What I'm talking about. Out to y'all. Thanks for the questions, y'all. Thank y'all for the questions. <laughs> And for this week's feature of the week, we are featuring our friend Raphael Small. Yes. Yes. Raph. Raph decorated my place. Yes. And it, it is, is so beautiful. beautiful. Yes. Thank you so much. And he is also a realtor. So follow him at Phil My Ref. Speaking of real estate, for this week's real estate news you can use, here are your tips. Are you behind on your mortgage or facing foreclosure? Have you ever considered accepting a cash offer for your home? A cash offer will prevent foreclosure, a failing credit score, realtor fees, stress and anxiety. If you need assistance or would like to know more, please email me at ravenjanaerealestate at gmail.com and I will be more than happy to discuss some options with you. Okay, guys, you know, we kind of spoke on family dynamics today with family and friendships, and that can go with negative and positive. And we always like to end our episodes on a positive note with an affirmation. And this week's affirmation is, I will always surround myself with positive people who will bring the best out of me. And that goes for family and friends. We want to thank our cousin thank for you. being yes. welcome. Yes. You're welcome yes. on this week's episode. Can't wait to see you guys next time. Bye. 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 This is
you yeah. not start that. Right, do this. Yeah. It's just like a little dot. Okay, there it is. Okay. This is okay. looking while you, this is looking while y'all talking. Yeah, you be so happy. Surround myself. Okay. Girl, you know how to do speeches, Easter. <laughs> <laughs>